we're gonna do some more Animal Crossing today. It's been a few days since I've last played this, so stuff has happened. Uh, but if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking, by the way. I have now gotten one more hybrid color. It's, it's actually funny. Just the day after I set up that, um, the new setup, you know, I moved stuff around following the guide. And though it wasn't roses, I did get the purple, um, wind flowers. So I got two of them now. The day after I got, uh, ones <laughs> where I was attempting to get them. And then just yesterday I got ones where, uh, yeah, I move stuff around too. So there's no difference here. Also, it's raining, so that's great. I don't have to water anything today. Time saver. Um, That's a shame. So, I got someone to water my, my flowers, just the kind of... Get a bunch of these ones. Dude, it makes such a big difference. Like, maybe that's why it worked, but... Strangely enough, I got two gold roses out of this. I don't, I don't know how that worked. They didn't use a golden watering can, but I still got them. So, I don't know. But this is now not hybrid yellow. I mean, sorry, hybrid red. It's special red. So I take the result of this and go put it in the top corner. And then hopefully that'll eventually lead to blue. As long as whatever comes out of this is red. Because, yeah, this just erupted and I kind of shoved them in the corner. Um, I'm going to bring this with me. Yeah, it's just blue roses, that's it, like... If I get them, then I can finally start moving towards finishing this. So, yeah, it was nice to get them. Though I did call it, I was like, just you watch, the next day, I'm gonna get one. And it's gonna make me regret moving things. I don't fully regret it. Um, but... So, like, here, for example, now, this is where the other one sprouted up. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this. Because it's something like half of these will be ones that generate purple. So, we'll see. But I'm hoping now with two of them, I can generate more purple easily. So, I'll go and move these over there. But, I mean, it's looking good. Once I get enough purple, I can kind of start... ...clearing things out a bit. Um, what I'll do... Yeah, I just want to add padding. Just so there's enough separation between the red and the black ones. Anyway, that's the state of things. I also did leave my Switch running <laughs> in the evening whilst I was watching stuff, just chilling, and I got a bunch of recipes. Hey, Shell. How's it going? No golden armor, but a bunch of other recipes I got just by standing there and just whenever I heard a balloon, I would turn to my switch and just get it. Getting pretty good, how am I? Doing okay, middle of the week for me, just waiting for tomorrow. Tomorrow's just the last day of work for me. I got a public holiday on Friday. Yeah. 
The, uh, the new flower system worked. The very next day I got a purple... What do you call it? Wind flower, and then the day after I got another one. The roses are set up, but not quite there yet. I need to wait on one more batch to move it. Yeah, it worked. Like, just immediately. Though, I got one here, and then I got one amongst the reds that I planted the next day, so... I'm surprised- I guess the, these were- these two, are, I guess, were hybrid. But anyway, now I'm hoping with this setup here I should be able to get more of them easily. But it's looking good. With the roses, I've got a small pile of them. So what I'm up to... Because I did get someone to water them. Coincidentally, we're talking about Animal Crossing. <laughs> and I was like, hey, can you water my flowers? So they did. Um, but I got all of this from that and these. Just It's so much more efficient. Anyway. Um, whatever the result of this is, whatever reds grow here, I need to move. And then those are the ones that should generate blue. Hopefully. I somehow got gold ones with a normal watering can. Like, I don't understand how that happened. But it, it happened. I guess because they watered it, maybe that was the difference. I don't know. Getting one is hard, and then once you have two, it's, it's fine. The green mums were a pain in the ass, but I have all the green mums I need now. I don't need to keep watering them. I gotta look for the daily recipe. So, yeah, I mean, getting there. I think this chaotic process is gonna finally be over. After like four, four months. Four months of almost daily watering and rearrangements and stuff like that. I got my green mums now. Now they're like all neat. I loosely based Alice's place off like stuff I see on my walk. Gone. This, this is almost the end here. I just gotta put the purple one here, and then it's just whatever blue roses I can put here, and then this is done. Ugh. I should probably pay for clothing. I was amazed how many recipes I got just by standing still. I think it was because of the fortune being the possession one, I don't know. But the balloons just kept coming. Yeah, so now I guess I need to start the process of, uh, well, I can design villager houses now, so I need to, I guess, start that. It'd be nice if I could get it before February, but we'll see. I have an idea. Oh, but I don't have... Never mind. I don't have it. I didn't buy the Mario hat. I was going to buy the Mario hat. But it's not going to matter for today.
Okay, sure. As long as it looks visually different. So, I mean, I just have to keep stacking the red roses, and eventually I'll get it. So, I'll probably move the pink and the yellow ones from where they are. It's just under a 3% chance, so if... I guess if I have, like, just a whole bunch of them in that corner there, then odds are it'll happen eventually. I'm just gonna have to resort to that. Like, this corner here is just gonna get covered in, in red roses. move them now while I'm at it. But today I will decorate the villager's house. I'll just... I'll probably go scoot. That one is easy. I just have to make it like a gym inside. That's it. So... It's probably the best one I can finish off right now. And then maybe... Maybe here? Because this one's an arcade. That one... The theme is set. That wouldn't be too difficult to pull off. I have more ideas for this, but I'm not gonna start it yet until I can clear this. No, I think when this is all over, I would like to do a thing where I'm, I guess, time-lapsing everything. Well, not time-lapsing, but just kind of covering how this island changes over the course of me playing it. Though that would be high effort. <laughs> uh, sometimes I have ideas for videos, but then it's just like, well... Juggling a full-time job and wanting to do these ideas is often... often tricky. I did take a look back at how the island looked originally, it's just so different. Did I knock at the bottle? I haven't gotten it yet, so where is it? I just realized, why am, why am I getting fossils? I found them all already. I guess for money. Oh, here it is. <laughs> I did buy some stuff. So that throne I was saving for ended up going on sale. So I, I bought a throne, which cost me quite a bit of bells. And then red was over, and there was another item on sale, well, that I bought a bunch of, it's just, I, I have less money now. I guess I may as well unearth the fossils, since I already started. Let's get through this quickly.
There's two more somewhere else. I'm probably going to be lazy and just plant these flowers somewhere. That's just out of the way. I mean... Eh. <laughs> I know this looks messy, but... Until further notice... Well, what I'm going to do is just... Eventually all the fl spare flowers are going to end up here, and then... I'll just go decorate the houses individually, take what flowers I need, and then the rest get sold. And then we're done. Just, it'll look a little ugly for a while. Messy, whatever you want to call it. Okay, I'll leave them here. It's not that many. I don't know why I put that there. That's the two trees. I'm putting that away. I think I just moved it there and just didn't bother. Look, it's, it's out of place. Okay. I may as well on here. These last two fossils. Oh yeah, I got a bunch of stuff in the mail. Just waiting. It's like three days worth almost. So, hang on. I might do some color changes there as well, in that park. Where have I looked? There should be one more, because... Your island can have six fossils at any given point. Alright, fine. <laughs> that sucker ball is like out of place. Yeah, I'm gonna buy that soccer ball off you. It's out of place! <laughs> yeah, I'll buy it. It's fine. The funny thing is I don't think I have one. Maybe I'm overly sentimental, but I hope that you'll be very happy together. Okay, cool. 
Everything is as it should be again. Alright, what's the card game? There it is. Dude, for the past three days, I have gotten just destroyed by this game. I keep getting either a high number or a low number, I guess... I had a two yesterday, and so I guessed higher and it became a one. Just, that's what I've been experiencing. And this one's perfectly in the middle, so it's like a coin toss. Lower. Yep, good. Ugh. It's okay. I don't feel so bad when it's a coin toss. That's that's fine. It's when... It's like, well, there's only one number that it could be for me to lose, and I get that number. Where is the fossil? Is it going to be... What if it's like around the corner here? Okay, it's not. Oh, one of the rocks moved up here. Cool. I mean, I kind of like that my rocks are all going to be up here. What are my plans for Friday? Well... I gotta have some kind of grilled meat or barbecued meat. I have to. That's like a prerequisite of... Because uh... it's Australia, like, Australia Day. That's, that's the holiday. So it's... I don't know. That's the thing you're supposed to do. But honestly, I'll probably be up late. <laughs> so, I will most likely be sleeping in the first half of it. And then getting up and, I don't know, I might go get some meat. That's, I think, yeah, I mean, we'll see what happens. Because it's my birthday in a couple of days, sometimes people want to catch up. So, it might be like impromptu plans. I'm losing my mind. Where is this last fossil? <laughs> it's gonna be somewhere that I've overlooked or walked past like a million times. Honestly, public holidays a lot of the time, it's just nice not having to work, so I laze around and just enjoy the day and do nothing. Where is this? Is it here? I'm doing this because it alters the camera angle. There it is. Wow, that's sneaky. I've heard of Australia Day. I used to watch Bondi Rescue. Oh, cool. Yeah, I mean, it's just our version of 4th of July, except it's just... It's one of those things that the holiday itself, its original meaning, I don't think many people really care for the original meaning. It's like marking the day that the British arrived. 
But no one really celebrates it for that anymore. It's generally just a holiday that people... The gist of it is just get together with friends and just eat food, have a barbecue or something. That's pretty much it. I don't know why I'm doing this. I guess because they're going to be worth money. I like the public holiday because it's just the day before my birthday, so I usually just... It makes it easy to take a day off for my birthday. But this year it's like on a Friday, so that's... No need. Don't need to do it. Or if it's like a nice day, you go to the beach as well. Which it might very well be. I haven't checked, to be honest. Boom, 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 boom. Do I want that? I guess. Eh, you never know. Alright, do it. Dun, 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 dun. Um. Nah, I mean, it's not gonna be that nice. <laughs> I just checked. Of course, it's not going to be that nice. I'm still waiting on the doghouse. Uh, do I want this? I know this is hoarding mentality, like, oh, I might need it, but... This is a game. <laughs> it's fine. There's plenty of storage space. And at least I have options when I get around to things. Could be one of these things that I never use, or I get an idea and then I'll be glad that I got it. Alright. I forgot to sell the fossils! <laughs> Whoops. thinking if I want to bring anything to halves. Suppose I should go through my stuff now that I ordered. I got a bunch of things. Watching me play Animal Crossing has made you play yours more. <laughs> it's always like that. This is one of these games that the moment you see someone play it, it's just, oh, now I feel like playing it. Another one that does this to me is Stardew Valley. Okay. All this stuff. Oh yeah, there was a flame machine that appeared in... ...in the store. I bought it, and then I bought another one immediately. You never play that game? If you're into... ...farming sims, it's, it's fun. It's one of those games that the first time you play it, you're probably going to do a bunch of things that they're not the best way to do it, and then you'll learn something and be like, man, I wish I knew that sooner. 
it's just where to start is typically the most difficult thing, but it's it's a good game. And it's just another one of those crazy games where one person developed it. And has been updating it for free for years. So, at the very least, it's worth getting on that note. It's just... I mean, how old is that game? is like at least... It's getting... It's, I think it would be almost 10 years old, if not approaching that. Not much of a farmer. Well, that's the thing. It's not just farming. Like, the farming is... The part that you... I guess make money off. But there's other things as well. Like... If you want to just be... A, someone that focuses on fishing, you can be. And there's the whole personal relationship aspect. And there's mining. It's like one of those things where it's better than the sum of its parts. Like a lot of it is driven by just the interactions and making friends and furthering the relationships to a point where you learn new things about the characters. They're not cute animals, it's like a similar thing. You have neighbors and you get to know them better. Some of them, they might be like a little bit rough around the edges at the start and they open up. Couldn't donate that one. Oh yeah, I can. Okay, cool. Okay, where's the other? <laughs> I have the throne. I just don't know what to do with it. I think I have an idea. Is it? Yeah, that's that's where a lot of my money went. <laughs> Just random objects that I bought multiple of. Where is this thing? I can't search. I appreciate that there wasn't search at the start, but Happy Home has search for the catalog, and it's like, why couldn't you put that elsewhere? You could have put it everywhere, it would have been useful. I think I'm just tired and blind. There it is, stage flame machine, okay. I would like to make this this show downstairs. Although, I guess realistically, probably wouldn't have this down here. It's a bit of a hazard, but that's okay. <laughs> but is this one of these things that is constantly going off, or is this something that'll only go off? I guess we'll see. Alright, so let me just move these so I can get through. Oh, is this gonna be that awkward? Okay, there we go. I think I hit it. Where are the flames? Oh, 
I'm just gonna have to temporarily move these out of the way. Oh, I blocked it again. Okay. Try that again. Ah. Uh, oh, no, I guess it does work. <laughs> cool. I wish it would be, like, on the timer, but that's fine. It's like, yeah! Wouldn't be a DJ without, like, a pyrotechnics show. As you can still see it. Uh, that was just a spare warrior statue. Okay. I have that one? Let's see. Maybe I don't. I might be thinking of that one, Flamenco. Gumbo. Mumbo. There's also that one. Salsa. Okay, I don't have it. Samba. The other thing I have, and I purchased a fake on purpose to get this. Oh, wait, not that one. Which one is it? This one. There we go. <laughs> I got a second one. I knew it was fake. I tossed up the opportunity of, uh, Purchasing a real piece of art, but I decided, nah, you know what? This is more important. That looks much better now. Speaking of, um, someone's crafting. Should probably find that out now. Okay, I did get a couple of authentic pieces. Don't you worry. 
I love how he said, soon to be famous Scoots Gym. Oh yeah, I'm gonna redecorate this place and then it'll be, it'll be famous. Really? Nothing? Who's crafting? Oh, you're sick. I wonder if I redecorate the house. If. Because I let you buy furniture. If I was to place furniture I want in a redecorated house, would I be able to buy said furniture? Hmm. I'm just thinking if I can get that dog house. <laughs> just want the dog house. I'll just buy the medicine. I can't be bothered. So then, who's crafting then? Daddy or... I mean, I guess I haven't checked the Audi's place, but one of these two has to be crafting. There you go. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately. It's one of the more basic recipes. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to Harv's now. And just buy the artwork and whatever else I need to do. Then Daily Island, and I think after that I can decorate.
Uh, that's not the real one, right? <laughs> Hold on. I think I have both. Let's just see. Because this one's holding um, books. Okay, there's the art guide. Yeah, the real one. The real one's not holding books. What about this one? I mean, even this one, even still. Let's see. The fake one will be wearing a necklace. This one's not wearing a necklace. This one's real. Right? Yeah, it's real. If I haven't donated it, cool. If I have donated it, I might replace the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> We'll see. We'll go see. Uh, and then, yeah, I gotta donate that stuff. I just don't know what else to put up there, but that would be an alright statute of place. sound. should record that sound and make it the sound when you get a message. You get an SMS. Get a text. Get a DM. Get any kind of message. Just make it play that sound. That would make you notice. So I have a friend that does that. Just his phone is just things that you take notice. His morning alarm was for for a while the uh, opening to the Lion King. Just you know the sunrise song. He had the, uh, the sound of finding a Korok in Breath of the Wild for a while. Yeah. <laughs> you recorded a Christmas song and put that as your alarm for Christmas Day. <laughs> That's funny. I got two things for ya. Oh, scrap that. I have three things apparently. One of them is gonna be fake. Okay. So which one was which one was the fake? 
Right, okay, yeah, that's fine. Put the real ones. I think that one I had on my possession, I just forgot to bring it here. Or put it away. Right, so do I... I guess I don't have that one. Yeah, damn, that's a shame. I would have liked to have placed that as a decorative piece, but it looks like I don't have it. I mean, this is, this is getting there. This is more art than I've ever owned, so... This just takes forever. The chances to buy art are not... Not that great. Do I have the coffee one? Oh. Okay. I don't have anything. I don't want to change the greetings. I think I'm good. Okay, uh, Daily Island. Still doing this for recipes and I guess just trying to get a dab from one of the islands that appears so then I can make fish and chips. Changing it. <laughs> oh, well. If it's not anything special, I'm just gonna grab the recipe and leave. Oh, I got it. Alright, cool. I got my dab. This is set when dab is available. Cool. I still can't believe they didn't pick a fish that's available all year. Like, what is this? I might get a few more cherry blossoms while I'm at it. There'll be a recipe from this period. What's that floor type? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's just pink wood. <laughs> okay. Well, that's fine. Um, let me get my dab. I'm going to be upset if this is just a garbage island. Oh, crap. Well, that's, that's even more bad news. Just please tell me... Okay, there's a rock. 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 I can do this. 
As long as the shovel does not break. Okay. Give me my fish. It's this size, I think. Okay. Um, how many do I need? Where is it? Recipe... blind oh there it is i need okay so it's only one that's fine i'll get a few enough to make a model out of and then maybe a couple spare just in case there's other recipes It's okay, at least I can I can make it. So I have to keep scaring the fish until I find the right one. start looking for something that disappears. Okay, let's just scare all these fish away. I'm gonna have to do this to scare it. There we go. Go away. I'm not interested in it. I just want you to go away so that I get new fish. Oh, here we go. Ah,
probably should have seen what that was, but... Just, I don't know, the odds are bass. I just want a few more. Just give me a, a couple more and I'll be happy. Okay, here we go. Ah, oh, I should have closed my eyes. I don't want to be here too long, but at the same time, it's either this or wait six months. <laughs> well, maybe not six, four, but still. Closing my eyes this time. Nope. It's really not going to give me the fish I want. I guess, sure. I guess that paid for the trip. Ah, oh, damn. I ran. Sorry if this is repetitive. I want my fish and chips. This is where I think they should have just used the sea bass. Let us make fish and chips from sea bass. It's a fish that's available constantly. There's no gap. It's nice and easy. Get it whenever. <laughs> Don't worry if it's repetitive. I try not to, but sometimes... If it's one thing I'm focusing on, and it's just not happening quickly, it... It can be something where you feel a little self-conscious about it, just... Sometimes I've had... Certain things that I chase, and then... It just takes far too long. Like, I don't know, growing flowers for four months. Might be one. Come here. Mm. 
Oh, that's not. Maybe it might be better if I dig up bait. I think I can do that here. Instead of relying on the respawn, which every now and then I'm gonna have to do this. Be a dab. <laughs> it's not even a rapish stop. I swear, just any time I start looking for something, this happens. get to decorating Scoot's house. You know what? Let's see what this is. <laughs> of course it is. I'm wrong. It's not the size. Oh. Right, I can get anchovies. I mean, I guess... Because I don't think anchovies appear now. I'm just thinking about stuff for cooking more than anything else. Because I do want to set up a couple of food trucks, so... That's why I'm concerned about certain fish not being available. is fish. I need just a few more dab. Oh, hold on. What fish do I need? Specifically the dab. Because that's used to make fish and chips. There we go, there's another one. And I would like to make more than one. Or at least have the ability to make more than one. Because I set up a fish and chips stand on the beach, so I might scatter a few around the island. It's just, for some reason they pick the fish that isn't available in summer, which makes no sense. Like, fish and chips, at least here is, it's a summer, it's a summer thing. 
or at least a very nice summer thing. You go to the beach, and then for lunch, you grab some fish and chips. You can, of course, have it other times throughout the year, but when it comes to, I don't know, like an island, that's what I envisage. Just, hey, summertime fish and chips. So it's strange they picked a fish that isn't available in summer. You can try and catch something. Nah, it'll be fine. Like, I'm, I'm here anyway. The... What'll happen is, if I say yes, then the curse will spread to you and... You won't be able to find any either, because indirectly it's like me looking for them. Hold on, I definitely want that. Come here. Wait, where'd you go? Oh, it vanished. I think that one's too big to be a dab. Nothing. <laughs> I'll try anyway. No, you know what? Screw it. <laughs> it's going to be... Uh, it's going to be a sea bass. Same with... Well, maybe not this one. I don't know. It's hard to tell. Yep, sea bass. Oh, still. <laughs> I don't think there's calamari rings. Maybe I should check, because if there's calamari rings, then hey, that's, that's a decent alternative. Cheers to your salads or vegetables. What? Uh, gut instinct says vegetables, but then it depends what vegetables. What veg I do I like? See, I like anything that's like a stir fry. Then your broccoli, your carrots, your snow peas. Anything where you put like a bit of garlic on that, man. Just cook it ever so lightly, it's great. Oh, 
Or as in salads, salads. I feel like it's easier to make salads uh, kind of eh. I don't know. Everyone has their preference. You gotta have the right dressing. It's like, nah. With vegetables, just either do garlic or do oyster sauce mixed with like, um, like a corn, corn starch to make it a little bit thicker. And you just stir fry that very quickly. It's great. Have it with a bit of rice. Yeah. Let's say, Nick, though. Ah. Okay, uh, a couple more. You like carrots? Carrots are good. I think when it comes to stir fry, I want them to be crunchy. Just not too cooked, just like broccoli. Alright, well, this is something good. Hey. There's a very simple dish that when I go to certain Asian restaurants, um, it's like Chinese typically, but it, it is in Malaysian as well. It's, it's Gailan, which is just Chinese broccoli, but they just serve that with garlic. <laughs> it's so good. Like, just, it's baby, it's like the baby, Baby Chinese broccoli, oyster sauce, and garlic. It is, it's just, it's so damn good and addictive. Some of my friends got me into that. And that, you know, I, I'm admittedly a carnivore. Like, you know, I will prefer my mates, but man, I'll destroy a player of that. It's just nothing but green. Having pork with it, oh, that it, that does sound good. Wedges and veg, man. It's a good thing I've eaten. I thought I'd be hungry just listening to that. Particularly wedges. Ugh. There's a fish and chips place near me that does wedges instead of chips. Dude. It's so good. I think all they use in their coding is just, they use French onion soup mix. It's like so simple, but it's good. Sorry, you made me hungry. Oh, no, no, no. I've eaten. I'm fine. I'm content. It's okay. Inevitably, the conversation goes to food here at some point.
Come on, just a couple more. <laughs> I'm really going to be here for half an hour. Something that I've been wanting to try that I haven't had the courage to do yet. I know friends that do their eggs in the air fryer. And you can use it to make pretty damn good eggs, like the type that they have in bowls of ramen. Where it's like, it's, what's the term? It's like jammy. Like, the white part's cooked, but then the yolk is, is jammy. But I've heard that if you're not careful with the temperature, the eggs can explode <laughs> in the air fryer. So that's like my only hesitation, but just being able to do eggs like that, man. Okay, cool. That's another one. How many is that? I have enough for a model. Wait, do I? Hang on. No, now I have enough for a model, but I don't have enough. Yeah, like a couple fish and chips. Nice. All right, cool. I'm done here, I think. Uh, I mean, the, the recipe is... Eh. You know what? I should probably get rid of this. I don't need this. Okay, one more. Probably customize the rod. done now. Keep the boot. Okay. I got my fish and chips and then some. Yeah, I mean, I was gonna get cherry blossoms, but nah. That's just gonna take longer. It's fine. Just... 
amazed at how many people are playing that that Pal World game. <laughs> Seems like everyone's playing that at the moment. Well, I mean, it just goes to show, it's like, one of those things where... This is something that I'm sure Nintendo probably could have done, but they just chose not to. And now someone has, and it's a success. Put away most of this. I do think it's funny just like how how blatant <laughs> some of it is. It's just like, come on man. Come on. Like what are we talking about here? They're Pokemon. I get it, like Nintendo doesn't own the the power. To control things that look like real life creatures, I get it, but like at the same time, there are ones that are just like, dude, I'm that just they remind me of when I used to go into like a dollar store, like a discount store, and they would have bootleg Pokemon. That's what it reminds me of, just that it's just like you would look at it and you're like, well, that's legally distinct to say that it's not Pikachu, but it's, it's fucking Pikachu. Like, <laughs> what are we, what are we talking about here? Though, to be fair, I don't think they've tried to mimic Pikachu. I have seen one that looks like Eevee. Okay. Oh wait, it's cooking. I can't craft. Um... Is there something I can use to cook? Maybe this? Yeah, here we go. There it is. Beautiful fish and chips. That does look pretty good. Alright, I can finish my fish and chips stall. Finally. I put this as a placeholder, but now... There we go, fish and chips store. There's a single potato, packs of fish, and the two deep fries. I mean, there's a barbecue as well, I guess, if you want, like, other stuff. This might be an easy thumbnail here. I'm all about doing less work. Okay. Hooray. Okay, now I can go decorate. Where is that? Hello? Balloon? Didn't I hear one? I forgot where I saw it, but like... There was a channel that was debating British and American terminology. 
so they were debating about the origin of chips, so like chips versus fries, and just supposedly chips is like incorrect. <laughs> Or at least calling these chips is... If you go by semantics, it's incorrect. Because they're very... They're too thick cut for it to be, I guess, what you consider something to be chipped off another object. It was pretty amusing, because the majority of the time the American terminology was wrong. The majority of the time, the American terminology was like, no, you guys are wrong. But then the one time where they got it right, where it was like, okay, you know, semantically, chips is incorrect. That's the one that the, it's like, fries is at least fine. Lies and slander. <laughs> it's okay. I didn't make the decision. I, look, I, I'm with you. Like, we call them chips here as well. You know what the weird thing about Australia is, is like we call potato chips chips and chips as well for fries, so we say both. So like fries are just thin chips, right. Here we're just, I don't know, like I've never had a situation where... I haven't been able to communicate whether I want potato chips or whether I want, you know, chips. <laughs> just, it's always understood. I guess the context is just, it's there. Chippy chips are so thick they've been chipped off a potato. Yeah, but they're not, they're not chips, they're chunks. It's like chunks is the more correct term for what it is. There's, there's something where it's like, chippy potatoes are too thick to be considered something that's been chipped off. It's more of a chunk. It's kind of like how wedges, they're not called chips, they're called wedges, because it's a potato wedge. It's the same with that logic, it's, they're similar in width to wedges. So they shouldn't be called chips. Because it's, it's a pretty significant chunk of the potato. I understand the reasoning. I don't agree with it. But I understand just the train of thought and the logic that gets to that, like, decision they made in saying that, well, it's not really semantically correct. Okay, let's go into Town Hall. The one that the Americans took the most issue with was jelly. It's just like, no, the thing that you call jelly is not jelly. He says, so just talk to him and then. Hang on, I gotta remember what he said. Holmes? Oh, there we go. A resident's home. Scoot. You're gonna get a gym. I'm curious as to what you can do in this mode. Exterior first. Okay. 
Okay, so now we got Scoot's house. Right, so something that is rep Well, first of all, we're going with Scoot's colors. Why isn't Jelly Jelly? Their version of Jelly is Preserves. It's not quite the same as Preserves, but it's like... They're taking fruits and they're making a spread out of it, effectively. Whereas in our version of Jelly is like gelatin. What do we call it? Well, we don't have anything that's technically like jelly. It's it's just, it's the same as the UK. It's jam or it's preserves, right? Or marmalade. But we don't have what Americans consider jelly. It doesn't exist here. But even then, them calling it jelly is not correct. We gotta go with scoot colors. Nah. I mean, the gym, I think, if I'm not mistaken, as long as green is the theme. I don't know if I wanna do a log cabin, but that's correct. Yeah, I mean, Jello is a brand, though. It's not like a, a thing. I think we're okay. I think that, that looks good. Yeah, let's go to the interior. This is gonna be cool. Can't change the size of rooms. Ah. Okay. Well, that's fine. All right, we got to completely redecorate this. So, goodbye, Scoot's place. We're gonna. The only thing you get to keep of your Scoot is this. Maybe this as well. Okay, um, I know exactly which one, this one. This is exactly what we need for a gym. I wish there was a yellow one, but it doesn't matter. It's good that I have access to everything, like Happy Home. Jello is a brand for Jello. It's just what Americans call jelly. No, well, jelly, the, the closest thing we have to it is preserves or jam, all right? That's the closest thing, but it's not quite the same thing. Like ours, I would say, would have a higher concentration of fruit, whereas in theirs would be... It'd be more like a candy, to be honest. Uh, it's basically like a candy spread. <laughs> That's what I would equate it to. Even then, that might not be 100% accurate. It's just, yeah, we don't... At least not to my knowledge, unless you go to a specialty store, I don't think we have anything that's close to that here. Also, I'm not doing this on a time limit. Like, I'm gonna make something that looks good for Scoot. 
Yeah, maybe this will look good, like a... We have something that's like a darker green, perhaps. Mm. I think that's fine. Okay, lights. I mean, it's a gem. I don't think we need to go too fancy with this. Two. Oh yeah, is there anything... Okay, so these are all Scoot's worldly possessions. Um... I mean, I don't want to get rid of all his stuff, so... And just seeing the word Han, that just reminds me of, like, there was a lady that tried to trademark the word, well, H-O-N, and an entire city got angry at her. That's oh, it's a shame that you can't. There's no hmm. What I was gonna say is it's a shame that there's no There's no way to make the room bigger. Great. Okay. I mean, just to segment this off. Home was... Maybe this might be a bit harder than I thought it was originally. Alright. Uh... Alright, I'll figure it out. I want a treadmill. There we go. Because we don't have treadmills outside, so... Gonna do this. Two treadmills here. I think this will work. Yeah, this this will work. This will work. And then because we don't have these outside either. I think this is fine. Place for Scoot to get swole. Okay, and then I want... Yeah, level two. Okay, and now... Scoot's got a place to sleep here. I'm not a monster, I'm not gonna get rid of all his worldly possessions. That being said, I want, I guess what's probably going to happen is, like I was curious, what happens if you get rid of space for what is effectively like a crafting bench area? I would imagine get rid of a piece of furniture to be able to do it. Okay, you have to keep your mini fridge, Scoot. You know, your living quarters are your living quarters, and then... 
We're gonna we're gonna upgrade you a little. Cause I know you have the tap for drinking water, but we're gonna we're gonna upgrade you. So it's a bit of a challenge because it's just such an enclosed space. Oh yeah, the window. <laughs> Cut about the window. Don't use windows. Hey, Star, how's it going? Thanks for the raid. Oh, oh things. Yeah, that'll do. I need to put this on something else. Maybe I can put this here. That's better. Give it an upgrade. Gotta match. There we go. I'm designing Scoot's new house. Which I'm trying to make like a gym. But I'm not timing this one. This one's gonna be just... As long as I want it to take. What else did he have from his old house? I'll definitely... Before <laughs> bedtime taking protein. I might get... Where is it? Was that fancy? Where is it? Maybe I don't have it. I haven't crafted it. That's the one. There we go. Although I guess... This probably makes more sense. Okay. Go with this. Available in yellow. Cool. Just sticking to Scoot's colors. Yeah, it's better. Okay, you get this. Whoops, not that. Just leave it white. Okay.
Oh, we can do different lighting if I want. Um, anyway. Do I got Scoot's poster? <laughs> Just... Mmm... Doesn't look like it. I got everyone else's. I don't have Scoot's. Ah, that's a shame. I was just going to put photos of Scoot everywhere. Yeah, I mean, Scoot is running a place of business, so that makes sense. I wish I had more. More patterns, I'd get stuff that's worthy of a gym. There's really not a whole lot else in terms of options. I might get this, that's fine. What else? Just wanted to see if coincidentally there was something. That might be exercise related amongst us. Oh, towels. There you go. Yeah. Work up a sweat, you got some towels. I don't think real gyms do this. <laughs> But, this is, this is Scoot's gym. Oh yeah, there's the wall-mounted bike now. Yeah, Scoot hangs his bike on the wall. The expensive ones might, yeah, maybe. Yeah, let's see. I'll put this here. My scoot's like a very active lad. Yeah. Just to make his... This work? Yeah. Oh, the lamp is in the way. Move it up one. Hopefully. Yep, okay. Of course not. <laughs> this won't work. Alright, never mind. Scrap that idea. It's nice to be able to take my time. There's really not a whole lot else I'd want to do. I think this is one area they need to just do more with, there's just more stuff to be able to hang on the wall. Spider webs. But also just more patterns. Up. 
I'm taking my time. It's not exercise related one. <laughs> Damn. Do I have anything? Oh. No, no, no. I have just the thing. This is this is a place of business, remember? His face, wherever there's a towel dispenser. It's like courtesy of Scoot. I do want this back. I'll just. Instead. Ah, uh, that's fine. Someone can do that. Um, well, I mean, but is that too annoying? Maybe I get rid of this towel. I think that's fine. Less is more. Hey, Scoot. <laughs> I mean, maybe this might be too harsh. Let's see what else we got. I mean, he did used to have fencing, so maybe we can go with just the fencing. And just bring that back in. Taking a nod from what he used to have. Nice. Mm. Yeah, no, that's better.
Okay, now the only other thing. It might be too big. It is slightly too big. What else have we got? Too small. Oh crap. Damn it, I hate it when that happens. Uh, go back. It's okay, I'll fix it. I think it was that one. Uh, what else have we got? This could work. Yeah, that'll work. As long as it's different flooring. And then even here, um, where's the brickwork? Again, taking a nod from what he used to have. Just do that. Yeah, that'll work. I like it, it's pretty functional. It's not what he had, but hey, there you go. It suits what's going on outside. Which is, he is running a gym. Okay. Let's see if I can mess around with lighting. That's a bit better. fine. I think that's fine. Go with that soundscape. Oh, I need to turn on these TVs. Hang on. There we go. Okay, that shelf. <laughs> that shelf is not in a good spot. It's not functional. Uh, hold on. I mean, as, as nice as it looks. Let me just put that there. And just raise it ever so slightly. And I think that's fine to be there. Have like Scoot's album art, maybe. Doesn't look like it. Hold on. 
Hold on. I doubt this is going to work. It'll be amazing if it does. What would it be under, though? Had to walk the dogs. Oh, that's fine. All good. I'm just decorating one of the village's houses, so it better suits the theme that's going outside. How are the doggos, anyway? You said you were having a trial adoption with another dog. <laughs> I don't think it gives me access to my gyroids. Let's see. They're good. Definitely gonna keep the dog as awesome. Well, that's good to hear. Yeah, I mean... It's most likely a case of the previous environment just not being the right fit. Oh no, yeah, okay, I do have access to the... Uh... Yeah, here we go. Cool. Damn it! It would have it would have been amazing if I could put it on the treadmill. <laughs> That's what I was going for. But what I can do instead, which I think will, will be just as good as if I put it just directly in front of here. Nah, it would have been great. But I'll settle for this. Just putting one here. Just in front of the dumbbell, barbell, whatever it is. And it's just, it's gearing up to lift. <laughs> I think it's fine. Yeah, I think it, it fits. But otherwise, cool. <sighs> Can I turn these machines on? Oh, there we go. Right, here we go. There we go, Scoot. And I kept the spirit of your room. It's more or less the same. Your drinking tap has been upgraded. Uh, can I use it? No. It's okay. You now have two bathrooms. It's, yeah, it's a fully functional gym. Okay, the only other thing I guess I have to do... This, I guess, should be here now. There we go. Now it lines up, right? Yeah, well, this will be an easy thumbnail. Is there? A, I know there's a flex one. Flex, Scoot. Come on, you can do it. Flex. You can do it. They usually join in. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> He's just confused. Yeah, this is gonna look nice. Uh, I think I'm done. And this one I took my time on, because I want it to fit and look good. Not that it was anything complicated. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, hang on. Can I modify Scoot? No, I can just make him fade in and out of existence. I mean, that's a shame, like, I can't... I can't get him to do a pose. It's weird because the photo studio has that feature, but this doesn't. Anyway. Hold on. Is it instant, or do I have to wait till tomorrow? Those pitch is going to go great with Scoot. You've done your part now, now it's time for me to do mine. I'll work with Scoot so we can start. Everything should be just like we talked about by tomorrow. Uh, uh, it's okay. <laughs> Not only is he charging me to do this, but he's also making it happen tomorrow. Happy home, I get paid to be the designer. But the house will look nice. The colours will be yellow and green, and it'll match everything about this. It'll look good. And then I just gotta do this for every other house, is just make it fit. So, I mean, the next one I'll do, because it's one per day. The next one I'll do... Might even be this one. Like this one I don't think the exterior has to change at all. I think the interior I just might add like a... Like, I think I'm gonna follow the, pretty much the identical design, which is... Because you can't increase the size of the room, unfortunately. I think I just have to put a sleeping area in the back corner and then whatever I want to do with them. Provided it's not a house. So for this one I'm gonna put like... A counter and a register, so it's like, oh, you go in there and, you know, you pay for your food. There might be a table or two in there. So, set up the tea house. And then I guess for here, I'll just finish the arcade. Turn the house into something that fits the rest of this. I got these chairs now, which is nice. It's like... Oh, that reminds me. I got some other recipe I want to try. I'm not sure what it's going to look like, but it's another one of these. Okay. Excuse me, excuse me. star fragments that they are. I want to see what this looks like. Yeah. Crafted an asteroid. Can't customize that. Alright, so what does this look like? Oh, it's a rock that's levitating. I mean, I don't know. What would I even use this for? within the theme of the space arcade, but... Oh, Scorpion. I'm here. I 
I don't know. <laughs> it just feels weird. I guess if I use it for a backdrop, like, I'll place the bin behind it. Hey, it's... Like a floating asteroid. Right next to a bin. Space debris. Place your space debris here. Oh, I can't even use the bin ones like that. How about if I... I think I have to do this instead. Ah, uh, cool. That's fine. Alright, well, I just have to hope for the best for the rest of this flower stuff. It's like... It's getting there. Just... Hopefully what I've done now will work for the blue roses. At the very least, the purple hyacinth, um, what do you call it? Wind flowers are there. I just want more of them. Nearly there. I think within the next... Hopefully within the next month. This should be done, flower-wise. Dude, I can't believe I've been growing this stuff for like, four months. Alright, uh, I guess the last thing I gotta do is just find the daily furniture. Oops. Cool island, thank you. Ah. Still working it out. Just have to get the last of the hybrids. And then I can finish it off. Oh, Flex here. I gotta get a model as well. of it are, are admittedly a mess, but I'll clean it all up once I've gotten my final hybrids. I think at least half of the flowers are gonna go. It'll just be whatever I want to use. There we go. That's one.
And that's two. Okay. Uh, I guess money rock while I'm at it. I forgot to go check um, the Happy Home Island to see if the recipe was okay. Hmm, thought I saw a fly. It's okay. Well, I guess I don't need to save up for the throne anymore. I don't think I need to exchange the pokey. Unless there's some other expensive item. Because that's what I was doing, but now, since I bought it, there's no reason. Check the restaurant. I'm gonna be running out of recipes. I'll just quickly check the store and see if there's anything I'll be interested in. I can't believe after just so many builds or views that it doesn't let me buy the doghouse. Still nothing. Uh, I mean, I guess I just have to keep checking. 
should shop at some point. If the exchange rate is good, I'll exchange. Ah, that's not bad. Oops. I might still buy stuff here. Alright, uh, as far as, like, other stuff I want to order... Oh yeah, right, I found this. But I don't think this belongs in an arcade. I think if I was to start, like, a casino or something, I'd probably start a casino, if there's a roulette wheel or something. But I mean, otherwise, I think I'm just gonna go for a simple panel. Can't go wrong with those. I was just seeing if there was anything that I might want, but... to seeing how Scoot's house is going to look tomorrow. There's something else that I j just remembered. Where is it? Yeah, this. I mean, I don't have the giant robot yet, but that might be good to put in the arcade, just in its place for now. I just, I'm gonna go customize it, I don't think green's right. See what other colors. I know it comes in blue. I mean, blue is fine. Oh, ooh. 
That looks kind of cool, but I don't really have anything that's red there. So I guess blue. Now I have an idea. Whether or not it's gonna work, I guess we'll see. I'm curious if you can place objects in it, because if you can, if you can, um, let's just see. Best I'll put other stuff away. Probably not that. <laughs> this would be this would be creepy. What else? I'm just thinking of things that would look absurd in there. Oh, I got the perfect one. Hang on, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I made one and I thought this thing is so ugly. Like, what would I use, ever use it for? This thing. <laughs> Oh, I need, I need, hang on, I need to eat something. It's assuming it works the way I think it does. Uh, where is that? Just, I cannot, anything. Otherwise, my other idea was to put an object behind it so then it looks like it's inside, but it's not. It's just... Okay, let's see. The question is, can it even fit here? How, how big is this thing? Hang on. Let's just get rid of the fencing here. I bet it's I bet it's three by three and that's why it doesn't fit. Oh no, no that, that doesn't look like that's three by three. That's definitely two by two. Okay. Oh my god, it works. <laughs> it works. Wait, but like... How come this didn't work? 
Okay, the piggy bank works. Mannequin doesn't work. Skeleton doesn't work. You know what? I like I like the lore of that. Okay, then we're gonna continue working on this. That is cool. I need to get my simple panels. So... I think the gnome is fine, it's just the lore as my security. My security team is just a bunch of clone gnomes. Okay, I need to get the panels. Evil science lab. I mean, I could. I don't know. I just don't think any villager would fit that. You could definitely do something horror with this. It's just a shame that the skeleton can't be placed in there. That would have been cool. It seems it can't be an object that's too tall. I'm gonna see what else I've got. So it has to be similar to the gnome and the pig. Skeleton's out of the question. That's out of the question. So keep these. See what else I have. So far, the gnome is the front runner. Oh, yeah, I got these out. I need two. <laughs> Flamingo. Butterfly. Pumpkin. Uh, I think the gnome's probably the best bet right now. I mean, you could probably put one of these toys in there, but I don't know. I think the gnome is probably the best themed one. That could work as well. Especially because this glows... glows at... I'm gonna see how this looks. Because that has eyes that glow at night. That might look like extra creepy. Oh, I need more customization kits. To, oh, no, it's fine. Actually, I should sell the recipes. I was gonna sell bugs, but Blick is in town. Um, but these aren't necessary anymore. Okay.
See, it would be cool if it wasn't just Mario stuff that was in the game, like if it had Metroid stuff. I'd totally put a Metroid in that tank. It would look cool. Oh wait, customize. Might be better than the toy, well, the big robot thing. Okay, so how did I do this? It was like. I guess I have to do it this way. Because I was being very weird about it. Yeah, okay. No, that, that is definitely creepier than the gnome. I like it. I mean, don't get me wrong, like, the, the story of, like, my the security for the venue being gnome clones, that's good, but this is... I think this fits the theme better. have to be facing that way. No call it fixed up. Nice. Ah, there we go. That's just because the eyes glow at night, it just looks extra fitting. And then I guess I just have to make the house match, which I can do tomorrow. This will be the next house I decorate, I think, and then I can finish it. I think ultimately what I'm gonna do is replace the side fencing with cubes, so then it's like more lights, but I don't know, we'll see. That looks cool. I guess. At the end, if I do get the toy, well, the big robot, I could probably place it here. Because Godzilla, as cool as it looks, it's not really in the same realm as this. Like, Godzilla's not from space. You could argue the big robot is like a Transformer or something, and it comes from space. I don't know. S space Godzilla. I think if I do get it, it's just that one recipe, I still don't have it. Alright, cool, I'm happy with this. Alright, well this is about all I can do for now. Scoot will get his house tomorrow and then I'll do this, this house tomorrow. I'll make the arcade 
building and probably do the same indoors, just add more gaming stuff. So. I'll get around to each house, and then hopefully I'll have blue roses by then, who knows. I'm trying. Alright, well, that's it for Animal Crossing, but the stream is not over. I'm going to swap to Mario Odyssey, because that's another thing I'm playing at the moment. But, if you were watching this later on, on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end, and hope you enjoyed. If you do want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button, or you can also watch me do other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. Either way, it does help out a lot, so hope you do check it out. Alright. We'll uh, see you next time, YouTube.